Hi, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Z. So hello, welcome to the channel. Um, thank you guys so much for liking, commenting, and subscribing as well on this channel. It's greatly, greatly appreciated. So this is going to be a um, love read for cancers. I just got finished doing a read for the cancer channel, y'all. It's called Cancer Guys Tarot. So if you're new here and you a cancer, go ahead and check out the cancer channel. you probably already seen it before, but yeah, it's called Cancer Guys Tarot. So yeah. Um, let's see what shows up for Cancers. Oh, I'm going to start off with using the um, Romance Angels cards deck, y'all. But I'm going to pull out my Love Oracle deck right here. I haven't used that one in a while on the channel. So, yeah, I was like, let me just bring this one back, okay? If you are interested in a personal read, too, use the link, tree link, in my description box below. So, we got Release Your Ex that showed up. I'm not going to take it, y'all, because I wasn't asking. I was just, like, shuffling or whatever. So, I don't know if it was, like, for me or what. But, look, <laughs> I'm going to just drive on my time. But for some of y'all, you could be needing to release an ex. Okay. Clear out your energy. But also, too, I just got that an ex has not released you. It's like they could be wanting to work on a partnership. But it's like you don't already release them. Like, you already cleared them out from, from your energy. So, it's like yeah what message is the for cancers oh so we got trust that's showing up cancer first card out y'all so it says this situation is calling for you to have faith let's see some of you guys are about to be spending time with a new person with honeymoon yeah someone and it's someone that you could be not now, for some people, this could be someone that you're separated from. But if you're single, single, it's somebody new. You not like you separate. You're currently separated from them. Well, technically, you're separated from them because y'all ain't together. If you're watching this read, but yeah, honeymoon is showing showing up here. For some of y'all, you're about to be spending time with a new person. What other messages? And if you are separated from this person, it's saying to just trust the process. Like trust, have faith about the situation. If you guys have not spent time together, if you guys are separated. What other messages do you have for cancer? Look, tell me why. Listen, okay, so the card was for cancer. Release your ex showed up. The time has come to clear your energy. Someone has, I feel like it's not you, cancer. For some people, it could be y'all, because you know the roles be reversed. And it's a lot of people that be watching, so I don't know who be who. But... Somebody has not released an ex yet. So this could be why there's separation. But somebody wants to give, oh, whoever was trying to release the ex or needed to release the ex, they was trying to work on a partnership or a relationship. But we got new love that's showing up here too. So that your new love could have been, it's like the reason why you're not together with them or you haven't met them. Is because they needed to release an ex. They they did not clear out their energy to welcome in the new energy like a new person. So yeah, let's see. Give me one more for Cancer. Yeah, getting to know each other. So you're going to be getting to know someone new. Now, if there was some type of separation or like, um, because the cancer read that I just did, y'all, on the main channel, I mean, on the other channel, the cancer channel, there was, it's like a connection where you could have met the person, but you, you were never in a relationship with them, if that makes sense. So like, you know, everybody got their own story. So whatever the connection is it's like maybe you didn't really know the person so it looks like you guys are going to get to know someone here it says as you reveal your innermost self to each other your bond deepens yeah there's going to be some information too that's being revealed to you about this person but it's saying you deserve love here as well you are lovable i do feel like maybe um either you can't start the other person whoever the ex was y'all they was not giving the person or you the love that they deserve So let me see. Okay, so I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go in real quick with my love or deck. I haven't used this one in a minute. Clarify trust for cancer. Ooh, yeah. Somebody was like on and off with the X, y'all. Hold on. Card fill. Yeah, somebody was on and off with the X. We got take a pic, can't post it. That's showing up. 
but then on and off is here. That's why I said somebody was like on and off with the ex. They didn't really, it's like, is y'all on or is y'all off? Like what happened? They didn't really fully clear out their energy. It's like, you can't be on and off with a person. Y'all, it's like an in and out type of energy. That means you have not really cleared out your energy. You haven't fully released that person. Clarify, release your ex. Yeah, keep that same energy. You show me the real you at the bottom of the deck. So with that, keep that same energy. There was no reciprocity. So yeah, with this right here, somebody was not, it, it wasn't like an equal um, exchange in regards to like energies. Um, and also too, it's like the love that they were receiving. Like whatever this is, it's like very draining. Like what in the world? Especially with release your ex, the time has come to clear your energy. So it's like emphasizing like energy. Somebody's ex or somebody was draining their energy. Let me see. Clarify getting to know each other. Yeah, so this card, you show me the real you. Somebody's true colors were definitely shown in a situation. But I feel like too, this person is going to reveal their true colors to you, Cancer. I feel like it's a situation where... They were interested in you. They could have seen you like as a new love, but like they didn't fully release their ex or maybe the ex didn't fully release them, if that makes sense. So it's like, hey, this person's about to reveal, like they about to show you the real them. The re It's like everything. But I do feel like they could have trust issues as well. Somebody has like trust issues in regards to like money. I don't know why that's showing up. But I'm going to get one more for getting to know each other. Because, like, I had already talked about you showed me the real you. True colors were shown. Tell me about getting to know each other. Yeah, so it's saying this is something real. This person is not going to be playing any type of games. Like, when you meet them and y'all are, like, interacting, y'all, they about to reveal who they are to you. But I do feel like, in a sense, like, you... Could have gotten left on red, or maybe you left them on red, y'all. With this no reply back, they about to. It's almost like someone's about to reveal some information on like why they were not replying back. But it's because they didn't release the egg, so it ain't really no surprise. But yeah, this is something real. This person wants to give you uh, special treatment. This is definitely leading up to long term like commitment for someone as well. And I do feel like this is the type of person too, y'all. They will definitely. Um, for like the women watching, they will give you flowers like randomly um, from what I was seeing. So let me see. Tell me about trust. Like they'll just give you flowers just because like it'd be like a Monday or whatever. Um, they really want to give you special treatment. Tell me about trust here for cancer. Yeah, Ten of Swords. I do feel like somebody went through some type of ending here. Someone's coming off as like kind of cold and it is the, the masculine energy that's showing up. But yeah, Ten of Swords that's showing up. I do feel like you could definitely feel some some form of like betrayal. I feel like someone is definitely like hurt too. But somebody's ending something with an ex. Tell me about take a pic, can't post it for cancer. Tell me about take a pic, can't post it for cancer. I'm not going to take this card, y'all, because the way it fell out, like it didn't pop out. So tell me about take a pic, can't post it for cancer. Tell me about take a pic, can't post it for cancer. Why is this here? Oh. Um, excuse me, y'all. My nose is running. Six of Swords is out. So for some people now, I feel like somebody was like moving on or there was like a need to move on. I do see where it's want you to know, Cancer, that something's ending with a person that you could be connected to or someone that's in your energy. Something ended with someone's like marriage too, from what I see. But yeah, with Take a Pick, Can't Post It in the Six of Swords, it looks like there's going to be an end to... Um, a situation here it's like maybe something that you don't trust or um, just trust that someone's like 
coming towards you or like you're moving on from something as well. Okay, tell me about keep that same energy for Cancer. Okay, all these cards want it to pop out. Yeah, somebody's coming in here. Oh, someone got blocked. So I do feel like either you can't to or somebody else. Someone that you're going to be getting to know, they had to block an ex with the Seven of Wands. But I don't know. I feel like there could have been some type of conflict. Like, I do feel like maybe somebody was, like, struggling with the ex or something. Like, I just feel like this Seven of Wands person, it's like they could feel drained because of, like, arguments, like, challenges or... um a person coming up against them they really needed to release it it could have been like a toxic situation too but yeah somebody's coming in with this ace of wands we had already talked about this y'all in that last cancer read but um yeah somebody's coming in they want to um it's like they want to give you their wand from what's showing up with this seven of wands they're about to release this x it's like they use that same wand to block the x and they about to give it to you. Tell me about getting to know each other. Actually, I'm going to do um, You Showed Me the Real You. Tell me about You Showed Me the Real You for Cancer. Thank you. Yeah, Nine of Wands. I feel like someone's about to tell you what happened. Like, it's almost like y'all about to have like a... Y'all really about to get to know each other. Like, y'all gonna be sharing y'all stories. It's like, stories on the battlefield. <laughs> Between you and this person, with this nine of wands that's showing up, I do feel like for some people now, you could definitely be, feel, for some people, they're, they're gonna show you the real you or you're gonna show them the real you. But I do feel like it's gonna take some time. It's gonna take some time because somebody's showing up here is like wounded. And we got the six of cups that's showing up at the bottom of the day but i feel like they're gonna like y'all gonna be talking about your um your past not in an unhealthy way y'all because i feel like that's not healthy when you go into something new and you're talking about your past but it's gonna be like healing with this nine of wands like you and the person getting to know each other like really just um it's like understanding how to love the person like what what they've been through in their past like you know that type of thing so yeah tell me about no reply back Yeah, if you have not received some communication from a person, it's like maybe you were trying to get to know them. They could have left you on red, you left them on red. It's saying to have faith here. Now, somebody could have been going through some like financial issues too. Um, but I feel like they're going to be communicating. We got the hangman. Yeah, somebody was kind of like tied up, y'all. I feel like in regards to like emotions, I feel like they could have been like scared too to reply back. Like they didn't want they didn't want to reveal anything about themselves at the moment. Like they weren't ready to get to know someone else. They was not ready to like reveal the real them from what's showing up. I do feel like whoever this is, y'all, it's like almost like they kind of feel embarrassed too. It's like a type of person who do, they don't like to tell other people um that they're hurt or like, you know, things like about their love life. They could come off as like very defensive, but it's like they don't mean to do it. It's just like that's just how they are. But someone's thinking about communicating. Could be an air sign for someone. Like a Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra for someone. Oh, three of pentacles, yeah. So these these are like some of the same cards that showed up in the um, cancer read I just got done doing. But that that read is going to be on the, the cancer channel. Three of Pentacles. So the Three of Pentacles could be, it's like a third party situation. Um, for some people, the ex could have been a third party or their work. I feel like maybe somebody was trying to work things out with an ex. But they ended up, well, they're going to end up blocking the person. Because it's not the same um the energy is not being reciprocated between them and an ex. 
Tell me about the seven of wands. Yeah, six of wands. So yeah, look y'all, somebody done blocked the X and look, they coming in. <laughs> With the six of wands showing up, yeah. And we got the Ace of Cups that's showing up too. Yeah, somebody had to cut a person off. Ace of Cups, so they coming in for the new love. It's like they tried to work on a partnership with the ex, but it's it was like an on and off type of thing, but it's just like, it just didn't work out. So yeah, they blocking the ex. Are you blocking the ex? And you're about to receive some, um, some new love. Tell me about the Three of Pentacles. Oh, and that could be why they did not respond back to y'all because they was trying to work things out with the ex. It's like they didn't, they wouldn't have felt comfortable or they was like kind of scared to tell you that they was trying to work things out with the ex or it's like they couldn't fully let the ex go basically. You know, nobody ain't going to be saying all that. Okay. But yeah, somebody single, single, nine of pentacles showing up. So you single, single, living your best life, Cancer. Um, just be patient here if this is like your story. Let me see. I'm going to ask for advice. What should Cancer do? Yeah, look for a sign. You could definitely be getting signs about the situation, this connection. Look for the signs. And you could be saying too, like, this is not my person, but saying no, like, trust this. Look for the signs. It's like um, the divine has been giving you these signs about the situation. Tell me more. What, what should Cancer do? Oh, we got a timing card within the next few weeks. Yeah. For some of you guys, you could definitely need to meditate here as well. Um, go into meditation. It's like if, you don't, if you're not clear about the signs, y'all, it's saying go into meditation. You're going to receive the answers that you need about this connection. Um, but yeah, within the next few weeks, it looks like this person could definitely be coming in for some people within the next few weeks. In the meantime, in between time, go ahead and um, go into meditation like deep meditation and to receive some answers and it's saying it's up to you um as well about this situation because it's kind of like you know you definitely have a choice it's like you can move on from a um like you don't have to accept this person but it does look like you're going to be getting to know someone new because it's like at first there could have been like no communication or like lack of communication. So it's like maybe you could just be like tired of that. You like, no, well, you know, I'ma just move on. Give me one more for cancer. So yeah, remain positive. So yeah. See, you're saying <laughs> this no card keeps showing up, y'all. I feel like cancer, like, no, I'm over it. Like it's done. Like, I don't trust this. But it's saying no, remain positive. To, like remain um like keep thinking positive about the situation and most importantly is want you to trust it says this situation is calling for you to have faith i mean this is gonna take like a whole lot of faith even though you only need this much faith but like this one right here i'm not really sure like you know the full details on it but it's saying like just trust it because somebody is i feel like they had a hard time releasing an x or like fully clearing the x out of their energy um here so yeah I am going to leave the read. Um, well, I'm going to end the read. I hope that it resonates with you guys. Um, and I'll see you in the next read.